we got baby chestnut trees. These are nuts that were going to be discarded from the supermarket. We managed to intercept them for free. So we planted them up. It was after Christmas. It wasn't in the middle of winter. It was after that. And you can see they're just starting to come through all over the place. They're also coming through on the other trays. Where are we? There was some coming through on this one. There we go. There's one there. So between them, we planted hundreds of trees. I've got a reasonable expectation of most of them coming through. The hazels that we actually bought, they haven't come through yet, but it's still fairly early still here. It hasn't been warm consistently for very long. So the chestnuts have just broken dormancy. These also have started to come out and these were also free, little tiny ones. Um, only a few of them yet, but this was on the bottom. Oh, there's another one. So these were on the bottom and then those two were stacked on top. But I've also found this little one here. Now these are the Italian, I think they're Italian. The, uh, the bought genetics that we actually bought in, there was a packet of them. Really nice, big, um, good size nuts. So we're just gonna give these a little bit of a water. Don't wanna give them too much water when they were stratifying over the winter. Uh, they can rot in the soil. So we got them nice and moist to begin and we left them well alone. A little bit trickles in from storms and so on. A little bit comes in at the sides, but we've left them well alone. And we've got, uh, we've got nuts, well, we've got nut trees. So, that is phenomenal. We put in hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of hazels this last winter that's just passed. Uh, we put in maybe a hundred or so chestnuts, so we need a few more of them would be nice. We got a lot more than we need, basically. So at this point, within two years, say potentially next year, if we brought them on aggressively enough this year, by next spring, this time next year, a little bit earlier, we could be easily selling maybe four or five hundred pounds worth of chestnut trees that cost us nothing except a single bag of compost and a little bit of time.